1999, businessman and naturalist Todd Peterson took over ownership of an aquarium situated in the basement of Minnesota's Mall of America and promptly turned it into one of the most incredible shark encounters on the planet. We've taken on ourselves to be the ultimate shark experience. I mean, we, people come here for the sharks and we want them to engage in our sharks in every way we possibly can that is responsible to the animals and safe to the guests, but still providing a thrill they couldn't imagine. Only while seeing these man eaters up close was a thrill in its own. Todd now wanted to take the visitor encounter one step further. That is, beyond the glass, to invite visitors to actually get in the tank and swim with the sharks, turning a visit to the mall into a very real and dangerous adventure. All right, if you guys want to just have a seat at the table. Leading the dive will be Lisa McCartney, an experienced marine biologist and diver who's been integral in the exhibit's success. Joining her today are four mall visitors. Each are scuba certified and have made the reservations and paid the nominal fee to take on this challenge. But first, there's one very critical test to keep the divers safe. The residents must be fed. Since we have sharks and stingrays and fish and sea turtles in there, there's a lot of opportunity for animals to decide that they'd like to prey on each other instead of what we'd like them to feed on. So if we feed them all at the same time, what we've done is we can condition them to come to different areas. So we have one station where the sea turtles go, we have another station where the stingrays go, the sharks go to their station at a different time. And what that does is it basically splits up all the animals. This keeps the animals from diving on each other and helps the keepers keep track of how much each animal is eating. Three more for sea breeze. The use of long tongs is critical to make sure the sharks don't associate food with people. Only problem, sometimes the sharks don't let go. So the staff must learn to keep a very loose grip. Sharks, even those in the wild, will lose at least four teeth for feeding and then promptly grow them back. The process is so common that in a shark's lifetime, it will go through approximately 25,000 teeth, which also means that in a tank of 25 sharks, there's a wealth of souvenirs for divers. And soon, with all the sharks well fed, it's time for the visitor's underwater encounter. It's fierce predators. Suited up, the group, including keepers Craig and Lisa, head to the shark tank. them safe from the shark's jaws. Instead, they'll rely on Craig and Lisa, each equipped with a four-foot-long PVC pipe to ward off any curious predators. Still, amongst the tank's five sand divers, the divers must be vigilant. With these guys, there's no telling if their next pass could be their last. The team submerges over the tunnel. At first, the sharks avoid the divers. But then, curiosity sets in, and Craig and Lisa must form a makeshift barrier. Each species, from the nurse shark even down to the wabagong, have human fatalities to their record. So for the diver, this thrill is very real. In fact, there is no other place in the world where a diver could swim freely among so many species. Still, there's no doubt who's the biggest threat. With each frequent pass, the sand tiger is getting closer and closer. Worse yet, it seems unafraid of Craig and Lisa. The keepers tighten the semicircle. Then, out of the darkness, it comes again. Yeah. Seeking the shelter of the tunnel wall, the group descends to the bottom. It's a good time to comb the sand for fresh teeth. Oxygen waning. It's time to surface. Fortunately, the sand tigers are keeping their distance. With everyone accounted for, 
the team quickly climbs up the ladder. For Todd Peterson, it was just one more element in an unparalleled exhibit that allows people to get a better understanding of these ultimate predators. I mean, they are just awesome, cold, magnificent animals, and uh, that's what makes it the ultimate place to go. We're going to teach people about sharks. Creating a spectacular safe haven on a serious deadline. Up next on Ultimate Zoo. <laughs>